one time he would see me struggling with it and he was like babe i can just do it i don't love to do it nobody asked you he was like and babe i can nice just do it Shh. Shh. he was like Hi guys welcome back to my channel so don't judge me today is my hair day so I took my hair down I'm gonna get it done tomorrow so I just wanted to deep condition it because I don't know how long I'm gonna keep the style in for so I have high priority hair so it which means it gets dry very quickly and it soaks up moisture quickly and then it's dry. It recommended deep conditioning regularly and since I'm gonna get it done I decided okay let me deep condition it today. So I'm gonna be showing you the deep conditions I use. So um I mean I just have use what I have. Some of them I use for because it smells good. I don't know which one works <laughs> but I know I just mix everything and just yeah I just deep condition it. So um, yeah, I'm gonna be showing it to you today. Anthony loves to do my hair. I I don't really do my own hair because he just like he was like, babe, I could just do um, I could just do it for you. Since then, he's been doing my hair. So this is my wash day routine with my husband. How about that? <laughs> okay, let's move on to this video. I'm gonna show you how I make my hair conditioning pool and what I do. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Hey guys, so I'm gonna show you the ingredients I use. So these are all optional, or except the olive oil because I have. Darcy. everybody can get hands on olive oil but this is just things I have and I was like oh I need to use it I don't I keep buying new ones and I never use it so you know you can just find one that works best for you and use that so let's go ahead and show you the ingredients so this is the repair and restore cream mask with keratin and monoi oil uh, by Alafia. I used to use this by myself, but I wanted to add other things to it. This is the Cream of Nature Argan Oil from Morocco for natural hair strengthening hair mask. I use this for the scent. I really like the way it smells, so it makes my hair smell nice. This is the Shea Moisture Jamaican Back Oil Strengthen and Restore Leave-In Conditioner with Shea Butter, Peppermint, and Apple Cider Vinegar. This is the Shea Moisture Raw Shea Butter Deep Treatment Mask with sea kelp and argon oil and also I'm going to be using just a regular 100% organic extra virgin olive oil so first I just use this I'm going to just use this spoon to take out my ingredients I don't really measure it I just eyeball it basically so right here I'm just mixing all the different ingredients that I have this is the shea butter um, one I got I think I got from the beauty supply store and I think I used that one because it's really thick, like it, it helps with dry hair. And I used the, um, the one with the red cap because it is, I, I just like the smell to be honest. <laughs> I don't know why exactly, but I just like the smell. But, um, and then I used olive oil because I saw um, a YouTuber use it when she was making her own goop. And I just mix everything together and that is what um, comes out. And so now I'm just washing my hair. I'm just doing a cold wash. I only shampoo once a month because shampoo is really stripping for uh, moisture. It strips moisture from your hair. So Anthony helps me wash my hair because it, the way my tub is set up, it's just hard for me to wash it. And so when he saw me struggling, he's like, oh, I'll help you. So here I'm using the Alafia Repair and Restore Cream Moisture Conditioner to just kind of co-wash it co-wash is just washing with the conditioner so just take out all the bad things and also this um black thing i you i got that i'm using i got that from walmart so i don't have to keep bending my neck because the, on the top i have to bend my neck and it's kind of hard to wash my hair in the shower i don't know how people do it it's just i just don't like to do it so i bought this from walmart it was like 87 dollars. i can't remember the name but it's just just typing um thing um, something to wash your hair with and you'll be able to find out on Google or Walmart, anywhere to be honest. So right now I, I do that twice just to wash everything out, make sure everything is out and there's no dirt in my hair. So I can put the pool in on clean neat hair. You don't want to put the pool that I made or, or you, that you make on, on dirty hair. So right now you can just see him washing my hair out. And 
oh you guys my my edges have really improved like i'm not gonna lie i have to tell you guys what i've been doing i in another video but my edges they used to be bald spots and now there's not i'm so proud of my edges they have come a long way to be honest this quarantine has really helped so now he's just using the poo i made and just put it in my hair make sure this gets into the roots of your hair the ends of your hair because the ends of your hair are the most driest part of your hair so you want to make sure they get moisture because those are the ones that break off quickly so sometimes when you're having problems retaining moist um retaining length is because your ends one of the reason might be that your ends are really dry so you want to make sure that this uh, when you're deep conditioning at least do it twice uh, a month if you can um, but when I have braids, I can't do that. But um, when my hair is done, I do it twice a month. And I have high porosity hair, guys. I forgot to tell you that. So immediately, like the next day after I did this, my hair was kind of dry again. So I have to moisture my hair every day, like every single day. So yeah, you want to really work that in and massage your scalp while you're working it in. As you can see, Anthony's helping me do. And then you also want to do the hair heat retaining me method so basically i bought this one off amazon so i put it on my hair and i put the um i forgot everything his name today i don't understand what's going on i put the blow dryer at the end and i make sure all my hair is in and i sit there for 45 minutes i mean some people sit there for 30 but while i do this i watch my shows or you can be on your phone or you can watch YouTube just to keep yourself entertained. And so you're going to see him start. Anthony just likes to joke a lot. Don't mind him. So you're going to see him starting. And I sat there for <laughs> I sat there for 45 minutes. So Anthony is, is just. So now after 45 minutes, um, I let the pool really sit in. And you can see the mark it's made on my forehead. Yeah. Excuse me. So now I just wash it out like normal. Just make sure everything is washed out. Also, I use a cotton um, shirt to dry my hair. I stopped using towels because towel really takes all the moisture from your hair. And now I'm just gonna kind of braid my hair and um, use that oil I showed you. The first one was a whole bunch of oils I used. Olive oil, coconut oil, castor oil, uh, avocado oil. I, I mixed a whole bunch of oil. And the second one was olive oil because I read somewhere that high porosity hair when you oil your hair you want to seal it and I read that olive oil is a good sealant for your hair or for high porosity hair so I'm gonna use that to seal it so right now um, Anthony helps me part my hair because I have a difficulty parting my hair and right now I have to I'm just braiding it and oiling it I oil the scalp oil the hair I make sure to get the ends and I brush it from the top no from the ends to the uh, roots don't ever brush your hair from the roots they will break your hair now i'm just kind of braiding into small pieces so it stretches out so whoever is helping me um whoever is helping me braid my hair the next day uh will be much easier to deal with then um it will be much easier for them and i don't want to use heat so I, as you can see i'm making sure there's oil at the ends of my hair and I'm sealing that with olive oil. This one really helps me part it. And so I kind of did that for my whole hair. And I'm making sure to make sure to I'm making sure to braid the end from the root to try as much as I can to make it 
um, to hold it from the root so the root also gets straightened kind of. Hey guys, so this is oh, out of my way, sir. So this is the look. It's not perfect, but I'm just doing it so my hair can be a little easier for whoever's breathing my hair because I don't want to put heat on it. But um, yeah, this is the video. Thank you, Anthony, for helping me wash and part the hair. Anthony, what is this? Huh? Anthony, this is the video. Can you no. look at the video? This is not a lovey dovey channel. You, you are putting oil on your face. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And I'll see you guys in my next video. <laughs> Bye guys! Why are you being so difficult? <laughs> it's just an egg screen.